topple. So I've been thinking about it, and the fact that you personally know the guy in charge of North Korea's cyber warfare program seems... What? Relevant to our interests? I was going to say treasonous, but sure, let's go with relevant. Who is he? Ah, Charles Watson, a.k.a. Chubby Chucky, a.k.a. Chucky Chubbers, a.k.a. Chubby McCharles Chomper, a.k.a. a Mid-Chubby Knight's Chuck, a.k.a. the man with a thousand nicknames regarding his weight. You remember all those propaganda photos of Kim Jong-il looking at cucumbers and radishes and shit, surrounded by North Korean officials? Mm Mm-hmm. There was always that one goofy-looking white guy, kind of chubby. That's Chucky. How did a waspy Yale graduate end up working for the North Koreans? They came to the job fair. Nice brochure, very glossy, lots of horses on it. Did you ever bother to tell Rollins any of this? No, but I had a good reason. Chubby Chucky's a double agent. (laughs) Hardly. My understanding is he loves North Korea. No. On our first night freshman year, Chubby Chucky and I shared a bottle of Pims and made an oath to never betray each other, no matter what. It's the most important oath I've ever made, Winters, because it's the only one that involved blood. (sighs) Lots of blood. Your pal probably had Deputy Chief Rollins killed. And I cheated on my chemistry midterm, and guess what? Chubby Chucky said nothing. He's trying to bring down our country with this virus. Well, now call me old-fashioned, but some things are more important than the well-being of 300 million innocent civilians. Besides, would Americans really want to live in a world where members of the elite are held to the same standards that they are? I doubt that very much. I'm your supervisor. I am commanding you to contact this chubby Chucky asshole. <sighs> Do I have to? Yes! Or I'll tell the Alumni Association about that chemistry midterm. Oh, you would not dare. I'm typing the email now. Do as I say, or I'll hit send. Uh, I was wrong about you, Ms. Winters. I didn't realize you had it in you to take the kill shot on an old man. Well, I do. I'm a cold-blooded hit send on an emailer. (sighs) Fine. But we need a secure communication strategy for contacting Chucky. We can't just put a coded message on the cover of Us Weekly like we're telling OPEC where to set the price of oil. He needs to know it's me. I'm the only one he'll trust. That means we're going to have to do this old school. What does old school entail? It means we need $600,000, cash, two identical briefcases, a Fialka cipher machine, a hot air balloon, Cadbury cream eggs, half a bald eagle, and a fake mustache. If I get you all that stuff, how soon can you reach Chubby Chucky? Definitely within the next five years. Five years? We need this mission activated by Thursday. Oh, next Thursday? No, this Thursday. Oh, well, I (laughs) know. This is going to seriously inconvenience my Thursday bridge partner. Which half of the bald eagle do you need? 